Environment Protection Act, 1986 – 19 November and 26 sections is an act of the Parliament of India. In the wake of the Bhopal tragedy, the Government of India enacted the Environment Protection Act of 1986 under Article 253 of the Constitution. Passed in March 1986, it came into force on 19 November 1986. It has 26 sections. The purpose of the Act is to implement the decisions of the United Nations Conference on the Human Environment. They relate to the protection and improvement of the human environment and the prevention of hazards to human beings, other living creatures, plants and property. The Act is an umbrella legislation designed to provide a framework for central government coordination of the activities of various central and state authorities established under previous laws, such as the Water Act and the Air Act. History This Act was enacted by the Parliament of India in 1986. As the introduction says, "...an Act to provide for the protection and improvement of environment and for matters connected therewith, whereas the decisions were taken at the United Nations Conference on the Human Environment held at Stockholm in June, 1972, in which India participated, to take appropriate steps for the protection and improvement of human environment." And whereas it is considered necessary further to implement the decisions aforesaid in so far as they relate to the protection and improvement of environment and the prevention of hazards to human beings, other living creatures, plants and property. This was due to Bhopal gas tragedy which was considered as the worst industrial tragedy in India. Topic: <laughs> Sections This Act has five chapters and 26 sections. Chapter 1 consists of preliminary information such as short title, extend, date of commencement and definitions. The definitions are given in the second section of the Act. Chapter 2 describes general powers of central government. Section 3 gives the central government the power to take action to protect the environment. Section 4 allows the government to appoint officers to achieve these objectives. It also gives the government the power to give direction to closure, prohibition or regulation of industry, pollution. The Acts has provisions for penalties for contravention of the provisions of the Act and rules, orders and directions. It also gives detail if the offence is done by a company or government department. It says for such offence the in charge and head of department respectively would be liable for punishment. Topic. Restricted areas The areas on which restriction has been imposed by this Act include Dune Valley in Uttarakhand, Aravali regions in Alva, Rajasthan, coastal zones and ecologically sensitive zones, etc. Topic. See also Air Prevention and Control of Pollution Act Forest Conservation Act, 1980 Wildlife Protection Act, 1972